So far, we have the connection to the UI text fields, the three of them, and now what we want to do is be able to um, trigger an action whenever we press the calculate button, and um, we need to be able to connect the button to an action in the code. So let's do this in this lecture. Okay, so let's go to the, to the uh, view controller .swift, and right below the right above, I'm sorry, the the ending curly brace, the very last one. Press enter a couple of times and let's create our function. So let's call it func and let's call it calculate. Okay, all right, and put uh, two parentheses, then open a curly brace and close the curly brace. All right, so now once we have that, um, we cannot connect it yet. This is just a regular function, but we cannot connect it to the button. Why? Because we need to say that it's an interface builder action, okay, so that the storyboard knows about it. So before the funk, press uh, one space before and do at IB action, okay? So basically, by doing this, we're telling the computer or the Xcode project that this is an action that can be seen by the main.storyboard, okay? So let's go in the main.storyboard now and let's click on the calculate button. Once you do that, go to the arrow, the connection tab, and under touch up inside, so you can see touch up inside, which is the, which is the equivalent of a press or a click, okay? You're gonna drag and drop the plus to the view controller right here. Once you do that, it found the calculate action, okay? And it, that's the only IB action that we have. So select it. All right, so now we have the action. Every time somebody is going to press that button, this is going to trigger the action in the code. Now, let's try it out. Inside of the IB action, just write to the console by adding nslog, which is basically going to write to the console. And here, we're going to log, we're going to log something that says um, calculate button pressed. Okay. Once you do that, let's click on play and see that happen. Okay. All right. So it's building. Build succeeded. And now uh, you need to bring up the console. So how do you do that? Go back to Xcode and right here you see a pane that has a lower uh, hide or show debug area. Click there and you see the console that just appeared below. Okay. Now a shortcut is command shift C. Okay, so that's one of them to bring it up, or you can just go, um, you can just go inside of view, and find the um, the standard editor and look for the debug area right here and activate console. Okay, Command Shift C. Okay, so make sure you have both panes in the console that both are blue so that they're open, and let's now go back to the uh, simulator by pressing Command Tab and press Calculate. So as soon as I press calculate, as you can see here, it says calculate button pressed. Now you can do it multiple times and it's going to write in the console calculate button pressed, which means that the connection to the IB outlet, uh, I'm sorry, to the IB action, calculate action is actually working. Thank you. Let's move on to the next lecture now.